G'day viewers. Today we're working in this beautiful little zen garden in Eagle Hawk Neck, Tasmania. Tricky removal without a high point. Very, very sketchy. So anyhow, stay tuned and watch us dismantle this blackwood. I'm always being asked why we're removing certain trees. This blackwood has to be removed due to this nasty looking crutch just here. This whole side here wants to peel off from this one here. As you can see. And the way it's been pruned, this whole leader here is getting heavy. I'm trying to strip it away from this leader here. So unfortunately she's got to go. HV line's just here beside me. Luckily we're not working over the top of them. The other thing that's very difficult about this job is this would have been our high point, it would have been way up here. So what I've got to do is, I've got to put a flip line on here and connect it to my bridge. And I've also got to throw my climb line out over the end of this one here, because that goes straight out horizontal. And just try and pull myself out there so that I can work all the top of that. That's, it, this phone does no justice, it's actually very big out there. No high point, so it's going to be a difficult one. One flip line on my bridge, and this one connected to my D's, just here. We'll take the climb line up, and we'll get it up there. So I'm just making my way out on this leader slash limb, out to the end here. As you can see, I'm starting to get a bit of stretch back now on my D. Ah, sorry, a bit of a stretch back here on my bridge. But I'm just slowly, 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 slowly releasing it. Just ever so slightly. Just like this. Okay, climb line's in. Hanging upside down on this now. Totally upside down. And uh, we'll set up a rigging point just here. And take all the end of this off. Still got my flip line attached to my bridge just here. Plus, I've also connected to my D's, but I'm going to undo that soon because it starts to burn into your hips, that's for sure, boys. And girls, we all know what that's like. Okay, got my X ring here. As I say in all my videos, straight from the Ace Tree Shop. I can start taking all this off here. Boys on a ground rigging device. I'm going to start work. Pretty strange place to be bit sketchy with that crutch there probably is one thing that i could suggest anybody else do and that is strap these two leaders together before going out on a leader like this just to keep yourselves a bit safer with the crack in it down there anyhow here we go reese is about to lift all the stuff up to me here we go go for it reese electric chainsaws Okay, to tell you the truth, you can do big, 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 big tree work all day and it's not as physically taxing as this stuff. This sort of climbing takes every bit of your bloody energy away, that's for sure. Okay, boys, you ready down there? Okay. Yes, mate. We're just about to take this first. Here we go. Little electric T535IXP, here we go. There we go. And now I've got to climb up there and get this bit off. Here we go. Look at this tiny little perch I just found to step on. Just there, just a little one, just to get a foothold in. Now I'm comfortable to take this here off. Drop it into the X-ring rigging here. I've had several of these little extension sticks. They all just sort of unfold and lock off on themselves. Can't get them anymore. If anybody in Australia makes these or knows where I could get hold of one, please let me know because, God, they make our lives easy. You just reach out, grab your line. Happy days. Nice work. 
just tie a good old fashioned timber hitch, go over the main rope, and then just do this twisting motion here, like this. Okay, pull that up tight, boys. Husqvarna 550 Mark II. Awesome saw. Okay, everybody, thanks for watching. So, if you want to see a bit faster pace of what we get up to in Tasmania, click across to Off Track Films and you'll see what we're getting up to. Please don't forget to subscribe, give the thumbs up, that uh, really helps the algorithm and also leave those comments because we want to know what you guys like. Anyhow, till next time, stay safe in the trees and see you soon.